my god, look at those ripples. Holy crap, that's a big fish. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, holy cow. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. This is a monster. All right, guys, what's up today? Um, it's the same day as I've caught all these other fish. So the, all the previous videos, it's still the same day. I've just been catching a lot of fish. I'm gonna be using a big worm today, a big worm trying to catch some big fish, and I'm gonna be using a big swim bait trying to catch some big fish. So my main point today is to catch any big bass or both in. Just wanna get some big fish in my hands. So hopefully I can put out some good content for y'all. So anyways, let's get into fishing. Not bad, not bad. Not a bad fish. Yes, sir. That was a bowfin. He destroyed my worm. I'm fishing this big worm. So if I ever feel anything hit it, I know it's a big fish. I'm gonna grab my pliers here. Let's go. A little bowfin here. This guy needs to calm down. Man. Got him. All right, there we go. All right, let's let him go over here. Man, I love fishing with big worms, dude, because you know that whenever you're fishing a big worm and you feel a bite, you instantly know that it's most likely going to be a big fish. That's the excitement about it. I was just about to leave this pond, too. Just about to go to the other one. To go fishing at that one. And then I got caught this guy. He's not a bad bow fan. My dad's happy I'm catching these because we need to kill these suckers. Oh my gosh. That was another big one, dude. Another big one. Literally the next cast, my line was running like crazy. Oh my goodness. Literally the next cast. Yeah, there's there's some fish down here, guys. Hopefully, I mean, I'm, I want to catch both in because we need to kill them. But at the same time, I want to catch some big bass. That's what I'm out here for. So hopefully, potentially get a new PB. But I just want to catch any, any bass four pounds or up. You know, I'm always used to catching these half pounders, pound and a half. Every now and then I'll catch a two pounder. But I need to I need to get on some big fish. I've been using big fish baits all weekend. I've caught a couple two pounders, a couple three pounders. So I mean my size is going up. And I've caught a ton of bowfin this weekend. Which we need to get rid of them suckers. But I just had another bite like crazy. That was a big bite. My run my line was running off like crazy, dude. Really? Oh my God, look at those ripples. Holy crap, that's a big fish. Oh my gosh. Dude, those were huge. Oh my gosh. Freaking looked like a shark was swimming, dude. Uh-uh. Oh, that's not, that's not the same fish though. This is going in the video. This is his third one on the rattle trap. He's been fishing for like 15 minutes. 
I'm out here fishing for big fish. I'm using the spinning bait and the 10 inch worm. Where are the big boys at? That's what I'm starting. Well, guys, I'm going to show you what I'm using. I never showed y'all what I'm throwing. It's a green, green pumpkin with blue sparkle or blue glitter in it. And I've got a couple bites. So I'm searching for the big mamas. We just saw a really big fish. Hopefully, because there's a ton of big fish in this pond. Hopefully we can catch one. Man, literally just as soon as I clicked off on my, on my GoPro, he hooked up on another one. Eight pounds, oh, seven lipless. ounces. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I, I've only caught like, I think I've caught like 10 today, 10 or 11, something like that. Hopefully I can get a four pounder or plus. Wow, it's actually a fairly small fish for this big of a bait. Man, anytime I get a bite on this, I assume that it's gonna be a big fish. But I mean, it is a fish. First fish out, out here with the big worm. Let's see if I, oh, I wanna show them to y'all. Oh, don't swim off yet, buddy. You ain't going nowhere with that anyways. You gonna get stuck, bro. Got him. All right, first one here, got him with the worm. He's a dark. He's dark, dude. Anyways, let's let him go. Yeet. Oh my. Oh, yeah, there's one. Oh, he's, oh my goodness, holy cow. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, holy cow. This is a monster. Oh my gosh, it's a freaking monster. Oh, he's running. Oh my gosh, holy goodness. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a six pounder, dude. Yes, oh my gosh, that's a five pounder. That's a five pounder, baby, on camera. Oh my gosh, the swim bait. I knew it was gonna get the job done. Oh my gosh, right at the edge of his mouth. I got so lucky he didn't come off at the bank. That is. <sighs> Let's put him on the scale. This is a freaking tank. Four and a half, maybe five. I'm gonna guess, I'm gonna guess five pounds, two ounces. That's my guess. Oh my gosh, I thought that was a bow fin. He destroyed it, dude. That did not take long. All right. Let's see, I got it right here. This thing is not working, hold on. One pound, that's not one pound. Two pounds. It's not two pounds and 11 ounces. There's no way. Hold on. Last try. Oh my goodness. Oh, there. Ooh, ooh. No, this is not three pounds, bro. All right, y'all tell me in the comments how big y'all think this is. I think he's a four pounder. I don't think he's five now that I'm holding him. But I think this is at least a four pounder. Biggest fish I've caught today. Look at that mouth, dude. Oh yeah. Am I videoing? Yeah. All right, let's let him go. Beautiful bass. There she goes. I caught that in the middle of the pond. Oh my goodness. I don't know what this one's saying. Oh. oh my God. Oh my gosh, that was a big one. I watched him come up and eat it, dude. That was a big one. I think it was a bowfin. The mouth looked a little bit smaller than usual compared to his body. But whatever it was, was a big fish. He, oh my goodness, guys. 
The swim bait is getting them, dude. I literally just tied this thing on. Like, not even like 10 minutes ago. And maybe the third cast I caught that big old bass. That was probably about four or five pounds. I don't think it was five. Probably four and a half. Scale wasn't working. But that was a bow fin. I watched him come up and pick it. I set the hook way too early. Got a little too excited there. Because, look, guys. This thing doesn't sink very fast. So, I'd reel it. And it's usually staying about that depth right there. But look how good that thing looks, dude. So it's, it's going about maybe a foot under. I let it sink for about a few seconds and then I slowly reel it. Staying about a, about a foot under the water. And it looks like they're loving it, dude. But I just missed that bowfin. Hopefully I can get... Oh, I mean, it'd be cool to catch a big old bowfin. But if I, if I could stay out here and catch like five, six pound bass, that would be amazing. All right, I'm going to go on the boat now. Uh, I caught that one bass out there, and then I had a couple of bites, which I think were both in. But I did catch a big bass. That was my main goal today was to catch at least one bass. Now I'm going to try to go out and catch more more bass, more big bass, and possibly both in. Whatever we can get. I'm using still using the sexy swimmer, and I might throw the 10-inch worm a little bit if nothing's working. But it's going to be hot out there. It's the middle of the sun, so I really hope I go out there and catch at least one more big bass, you know, just for the good video. But hopefully catch a quantity of good bass good for the video so y'all stay tuned that's fish Bowfin. He's a really good sized bowfin, guys. Big bow, biggest bowfin I've caught. Oh my, okay, okay, okay. Okay. Oh, he came off. Thank God. All right. Dude, that, that bowfin actually did not hit it as hard as I thought he would. He literally just gave it a little tap and swam off. Got one. Oh my gosh! That was the biggest bass I've ever seen. Oh my, did you see that thing? That was a huge bass. Well guys, just caught a bowfin. My GoPro died. So this is a little bowfin compared to all the other ones that I catch. It's a little guy. I'm gonna let him, I'm gonna, uh, unhook him and then go put him back. This is probably gonna be my last fish of the video, but I might catch more. I don't know. Another bowfin. Back to back casts. Two really small bowfin, but it doesn't matter. We're getting these guys out of here. This is like probably at least my 10th, at least my 10th bowfin that I've caught this whole trip. But I'm sure I've caught more than 10. So we're going to let. I'm about to go put him in the woods. So. I mean, this is crazy. My GoPro's dead. And here's my third bowfin just at this spot. I mean, they're destroying them right now. Third bowfin in like five minutes. My goodness. All right, guys. It was a successful day out at the pond today throwing big baits. I had that um, big bass that I caught, which that was the highlight of my day because it was just a pretty fish and a great fun. It was a fun time catching that. So make sure to hit that like button. Thank you all for watching this video. Make sure to go buy some merch and make sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel. And stay tuned for more videos every single Sunday at 2 p.m. And I might be posting some Wednesdays and some Fridays. But if I'm on a good schedule... I'll, post, I'll at least post every Sunday, but I will post sometimes on Wednesdays and Fridays. So anyways, thank you all for watching. Never stop fishing.